It was midsummer's night in the north, the night when the sun never sets, and all was still. And this was an island on a beautiful lake, in the land where anything could happen. intended to, but there were so many bees gathering nectar among the roses that I just couldn't fix that. <laughs> How many bees there are? We'll get lots of honey this year. How soft they must be to touch. Their backs, I mean. Bumbly warm fur coats they wear. Mm. It'd be so nice to touch them. Mm. Have you been upstairs to... Check the children? Mm-hmm. Camilla sound asleep. It's 11 o'clock. Where is Yank? 11 o'clock? Mm-hmm. Huh. It's summer's night. It doesn't get dark. Truly, an extraordinary night. Must be the sugar that he's after. <laughs> there you are, little bee. But uh, hold on a moment. It would be much better with some juice over it to make it tastier. Eat, go on. Mm, he's hungry. Mm. I just want to feel that warm fur coat. So soft. At long last. <laughs> At long last, I can finally play. How little they are. I don't know which one has killed him. Oh, this one is nice. <laughs> My heart is beating. Oh, how funny it feels. Hello. I'm uh, Dunderklumpen. <laughs> the dummy thinks that that nose is a large carrot. <laughs> oh, dear. Oh, dear. I think you are so funny. I will take you. And what a fine teddy bear. <laughs> <laughs> 
I'll breathe some life into you. Born on this day, and all I can say is how do you do today? <laughs> oh, and you are the cutest of all. Small for your pretty. <laughs> oh, you'll be all right. You'll be all right. Now, come along. <laughs> come along, polka dots. Do you think he's going to steal us? Well, if it weren't for the fact that my arms are so cold, I'd climb out of this bag. Oh, pretty, isn't she? Look, little dog. There's plenty of room for you, too. Come along, and you can sleep in my basket. I will not. Come. Sleep in the basket. It's nice there. No. Yes. Come on. No. Yes. I will not. I will not. Um, say yes, like a good girl. Come now. Or else I'm going to have to use force, and I'm... Very, very strong, you know. Oh, dear. I want chocolate. You know what there is in this basket? A delicious cake. Oh, no, there is not. It's true, there is. There is not. Hm. I'll see for myself. I'll have a look. Oh! <laughs> that? What can it be? Oh, a treasure chest. Not bad. Not bad at all. Jens! I want you home now, Jens! Jens! It's time to go to bed! Camilla is already sound asleep! Bumblebee, where are you from? You're in the forest? No, from Bumbleland. I'm a poet. 
I was heading south when I went forth, then flew off course and went north, of course. Would you please do me a great favor? Would you fly up and look for Yentz? Fly up? When I've only just arrived? Okay. You've the sweetest, most delicious kind of food I've found. So just for that, I'll hang around. sitting aft and chasing after them Jens and his goat crossing the lake on a raft. Follow me, Chief. Okay. and we are the Christmas gifts he carries in his sack. Lucky child who gets me. I want ice cream. I want ice cream. I want them. I want them. I want them. Ice cream in the woods. What an experience. This could be dangerous. Huh. What if he's after my pants? Without my sensational pants, I'm nobody. I know just where we are. 150 degrees by northwest or the other way around. <laughs> I put this warmometer in my mouth, and I feel my pulse, and it's two million degrees, and that's how I can tell that I am nuts! And who are you? You must be nuts to carry us all. <laughs> you are a funny one. You really are. Who am I, then? I'll tell you who I am. I'll tell you. I am Dunder Klumpen. From Mount Dunder Klumpen, as nice as apple pie, never hurt a fly, never did know why I was so lonesome. And when I was alone, I would try to cheer myself with music. Lonely Dunder Klumpen. Look for songs to hum when no one came around. 
always played the clown. Now with friends I found I can't get lonesome. Why have I brought you here? Because I wanted to have some friends. Listen, could I dance with you, Lionel? And may I dance with you, doll? First tell me, who are you? What did you do all your life when you were all alone and lonesome? Well, I I'll tell you. Uh, but first, I have to have an orchestra. Pelagilot, you can play the harmonica. And you, doll, you can play the spider web. That's it. And the dummy can play the nails and the hammer. And you, Lionel, can play the saw. Bravo, Lionel, bravo. And I can play the conductor and dance. One, two, three, four. I'm 42 years old. But I can think back to when I was two. Or 10 years old. Or 32, it's simple. Understand? No? Well, what I mean is I'm still everybody who I once was. There are times I, I feel just as though I were one year old. So I go like this. And other times I giggle just as though I were five years old. <laughs> oh, and sometimes I, I can whistle the way a three-year-old tries to whistle. And there are times I can break a branch like a 30-year-old. Oh, and times I, I shoot a slingshot, but I aim it like a 10-year-old. Oh, and I can shout, take cover, take cover, just like a 40-year-old. And then I can play with a teddy bear and fight with one as well. Do you understand it now? Do you? I mean, I'm still everybody I once was. That's what it was like when I was all alone and lonesome. And I played by myself. The five-year-old has remained in the 42-year-old. Yes, I was, I was 42 different people, one for every year that I lived. Because I was so lonesome. So lonesome, but... But now I have all of you. I'll never again be lonesome. Sing with Dunder Club Band. Shake your happy rock Play an instrument. To your heart's content with Dr. Glock. When you're in a slump, then play with Dr. Glock. Then I'll give way to some foolish fears are done. Hey there, boy. I'm one of the flying police. Tell me now, can you stand on two hands? I can stand on one hand. You know, what I should have been as a police helicopter. Really? The police calling the chief. The police calling the chief. Here he is. Man, where are you? Here! But I mustn't lose them now. They must be nearby. I heard them singing. I have to hurry. Chief, Chief. A helicopter. Did you find him? Well, naturally. That way? Wrong. Oh, that way then. Right. Thank you. You're welcome. You really ought to get moving, Chief. Oh, wait. Wait a second. Look at this tree here. Now you are going to see a great international circus artist. Yes. What are you going to do, Thunderclap? 
The dummy wants to go along. No, dummy. I just changed my mind. <laughs> that? Did you hear someone shout? Where did it come from? I can't run anymore! Stop! Lions here very well. It comes from that way. Then we'll go this way. We'll escape over the lake. They mustn't catch up with us. Here it is. And there are so many fish. Oh, graylings and salmon trout. How beautiful. But now, my children, we must hurry. Uh, do you see a log any place? Hey, Lenny, you know, you're standing on one. We'll take it. A dummy can really feel the high seas. Not so loud, dummy. Not so loud. Remember now, they mustn't hear us. Whisper. A seaman loves the waves that rock. The waves see them roll. The storm can shake a boat in dock. The storm hear it talk. now on the bottom of the lake thinks he's on a moon mountain.
Oh, help. He's catching up with us. He'll take you away from me. chest will be hard. Is it real? 
you all crazy, doesn't it? Cuckoo heads. Money, money, how greedy everyone gets. I mean, um, <laughs> 100 yards. How fast can you run them? In 18 seconds, I would say. That is great. <laughs> Think I can run faster? Not so. Takes me about several minutes. And by the way, uh, something more. Know what? I would like to know how far you can throw that stone. That is great. Best throw I've ever seen. Think I could throw one farther? That's as far as I can throw. And, uh, how far can you jump with both feet? Best jump I've ever seen. Could I jump higher? You win again. Look here. Two peanut butter sandwiches. Now, if you promise to get dirty and mess yourself all up, you can eat one, all right? Not to get dirty, ma'am. You can't mean that. What? Not ma'am. My name is Blossom. Now, where was I? Oh, yes. You have to make a mess. Is that understood? Yes? Then I'll make a mess. Oh, 
you can do better than that. Now wipe your mouth on your arm and your arm on your trousers and do not wash yourself. Can you whistle? Here's how I whistle. <laughs> your laughter is like music. Like music. Well, now you're all cheered up. Uh, why were you sad? Tell me what happened, all right? This creature stole our treasure chest. And the dummy and Lionel, and Pelenulot and the doll, then those mosquitoes. They all started chasing me. Then I came here. And now I'll never be able to find them all. Of course you will. Come, and I will show you how we can find them. Come, Yen. Follow me. Follow me to Bird Mountain, and I'll show you where everybody is. your father looking for you with the help of the bees. And there, there on his bicycle, you can see one eye. He has the treasure chest. He got it by tricking Dunderclumpin with a lot of counterfeit money. Oh, look! Why is getting away on that timber float? Float. Hurry up, Chief. There's a boat down by the shore. That's it, Dad! That's it! Oh, now can your father possibly catch up with that timber float and get the treasure back from one eye? Dad can't handle this alone. I have to help him. Bye, Blossom. See you. Hurry now. Your father's waiting for you. And good luck! Careful, Jens. Don't fall. Do you have to keep that goat with you? Do you? Don't talk! Please, let's hurry! I can see the treasure chest! Oh, that is really awful. They're about to catch up. What to do? There's one eye. We have to go faster. I'm doing my best. Faster if you can! Faster! I can't. I can't row any faster. Go on! That's it! We're gaining! Oh! Oh! <laughs> Those cuckoo heads, look at that. Now I feel safe again. Huh. <laughs> We'll get you anyway, one eye. What? What 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 was that? Stop a minute, there's a crow up there. Treasure chest isn't gone yet. 
I'll keep up with them. You'll see. It's really much better with one oar anyway. Lionel and Dummy, now we'll go home to my house. Wait a second, Jens. You and the goat had better go around that way. And the bee and I will go that way and we'll meet at your mountain. Now we must find the treasure chest. See you. See you, good luck. We're the richest in the world, so shout it. Sing it out so there's no doubt about it. Our wonderland is Thunderland. Oh, fun and wonder. Our wonderland is Thunderland. Oh, fun and wonder. Do you know what? I shall never sleep again in my whole life. We shall only play and dance and sing. D for two and you for me. That's all wrong. <laughs> <laughs> now listen, this is that gold. We're the richest in the world, so shout it. Sing it out, so there's no doubt about it. A wonderland is Thunderland, all fun and wonder. Look at that. Real people. I don't believe it. Don't stop. Come closer. It's me. The dummy thinks that house just spoke to us. I did. I can talk. Who said that? Somebody just spoke there. I did. Was that you, Pelnulot? No. It was me. I mean, I, the house. Do you know what? That house did speak to us. We don't have time to waste. We must hurry up now. No. Please stay. Please. It's been a hundred years or so since anyone has passed this way. And I've had no one to talk with in all that time. I'm so lonesome. Come in. Be welcome. Come in. That's exactly what the dummy would do. Go on in, Lionel. What's the matter? Are you afraid? <laughs> Open the door. <clears throat> well, uh, be it ever so humble, there's no place like home. Oh, 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 how nice, how nice to have 
someone stamp on the floor. Lionel, don't be afraid. Go in. <laughs> Yes, this is what I look like. And these things are all the company I've had. So please come in and stamp on the floor. Yes, you come in too. Come along, Lion Elf. Oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> oh, there are so many of you. Here we go, then. The dummy thinks there is canned lion in here. Is there really canned lion in this can? You are dumber than the dumbest of rabbits I have known. Opening up a can at both ends. <laughs> I didn't know canned food could talk. Dear canned food, allow me to help you. <laughs> oh, oh, how happy I am. <laughs> I think there's canned rabbit in this can. <laughs> Dear canned food, I shall serve you with smashed potatoes for Dunder Clumpin's dinner. <laughs> How funny they are! <laughs> Uh-huh. 
Something's burning. The dummy says it's a fire. See? It's a fire! Let's go for a swim. What an experience. What a blaze. But don't worry. I'll save you all. Wait. Don't leave me all alone. Oh, oh, oh. What a terrible accident. I saved you all. I saved the old house. I put out the fire. That was clever, wasn't it? You are the cleverest lion with polka dot pants in the whole world. But we must hurry and catch up with the others. Wait! Don't run away from me. And I could have done it. That was such a lovely house. I put out the fire. I saved the house. I'll bet you half a million it was one eye who set the fire. We have to hurry now. Let's go. And remember what I said. Oh, Wonderland is Thunderland. All fun and wonder. You know what? We saved the house. Can't we have some chocolate? Please. No, I don't have any chocolate. And we're in a hurry. Come on. You give me the treasure chest. Then I'll come. No, not now. Yes, now. I want it now. No. Yes, now. Not now. Yes, now. No, not now. We have to hurry. <laughs> I never get anything. Here. Take it, then. <gasps> She didn't catch it! <laughs> and now it's my turn. What an experience. It's one eye. What's he going to do? He took his head off. Is he going to wash his hair? Look out, everybody. The bravest lion in the whole world is about to attack. Whoa! Marvelous footwork, isn't it? Oh, watch out, watch out. Careful, my little lion. Now listen here. I shall look you right in the eye, so you can just give up right now. 
that clear? The dummy thinks one eye won't really take the treasure chest. Oh, darn, darn it all. He's got the treasure chest. Oh. Oh. And the way he runs. Let's hurry. We must follow him. Wait for me. Oh, hold on. Oh, what an experience. Hold on. Wait up. I'm on my way. Let's get going. Watch out for the ditch. Shift gear. Detective, get behind the wheel and let's go. Drive on. Straight ahead, don't spare the horses. Let's go. Step on the gas. There's one eye. Step on it. Turn left. Turn right. Watch out for the trees. Step on the brakes. Oh, I give up. They gave him a driver's license. Watch out! Here I come, and I'll sting you! What a mess! I'll get it! 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 I'm with a medal! I got it! a driver's license. The flying patrol is on its way and hunts alone. Hello, Yance. I don't see a soul in this forest. It's crazy, but it's beautiful. Hello, Yance. Giant, your 
Move on. Go someplace else to do your croaking. who that giant is? Take a good look. And don't you be afraid. It's the mountain Yorm. He is so nice and he loves to bathe. They're all asleep. How strange. over the lake and go up into the hills. My home is there. Hello! Just one second. What shall I do with him? What happened? Who's got the treasure chest? It dropped down onto the earth somewhere. But what shall I do with one eye then? Shall I throw him away? Good idea. A deserted island on a lake. But then I won't want to bathe there. Goodbye now, one eye. I'm going back to sleep. such a mess of it. The Chief and the Bee, Goofball Patrol Limited. Goofball is right. Yorm put one eye out there in the mist. Listen, isn't that, isn't that your father calling? Yes! 
Take the goat with you and start looking. Smiley and I will watch out on the shore. One million five hundred and sixty thousand. One million five hundred seventy thousand. One million five hundred eighty thousand. One million five hundred ninety thousand. One million six hundred thousand. One million six hundred and ten thousand. A goofball patrol is lost. Or do you know where we are? All right. Suppose you tell me, where are we? We are right here. All right? Slow down now. Turn to port. Slow down. I want some ice cream. Turn to starboard. We have reached land. you're all chasing one eye. You see, I have known him now for a long, long time, and he's not really mean. I know where he lives, high up in the mountains, in a little hut. To the mountains!
again. Grab hold. Grab hold of my umbrella. That's it. Oh, oh you are heavy as lead. Oh. He's not home. Guess he managed to sneak away. See that? Don't be afraid, Pelinilot. I shall save you. Don't worry, Ed. I'm coming. Dad! Dad! Where's up on top of that mountain? What an experience. York! York! Oh, why don't they leave me in? Peace to sleep. What do you want now? You must help Jens, that little boy there. Huh? Uh, who? Jens, he's over there. You have to help him. You see, one eye has stolen the finest and best teddy bear. Well, you certainly have made a mess of it. Yes, all right, I see him. Don't you touch him. Don't hurt him. I'll talk to him, all right? But you're so old. Why should you go up there? I know him, so I will go and talk to him. Leave me alone, or I'll throw the teddy bear down the mountain. What an experience. It's a disaster. Do you think that old lady can handle it? I hope so. What if she falls? Don't worry. She was born in the mountains. Just leave everything to me, Jens. Hey, where were you, Dad? Oh, where was I? Looking for you. Dad, look. We have to help any lot. Isn't that dangerous? That old lady going up there all alone to see one eye? Hmm. If you don't mind, I'd like to get up closer. known you, one eye, ever since you were a boy. You were the sweetest, kindest, friendliest child that I ever met. You liked everybody, men and animals and all of nature, mountains, forests, rivers. You were a good child. Yes, you loved everybody and everything. But as you grew up, you met people who loved only material things and money, who didn't love all the things you did. And naturally, you were disappointed in them. Now money is important, but not as important as people and animals and creatures, all nature and, and freedom. Freedom and happiness. Now you are free. Helen Yilot. Then your disappointment turned to anger, and you decided to get even with all those people by behaving worse than you thought they did. And that started you printing counterfeit money. So greedy people would hurt each other, grabbing for it as it floated through the air. Isn't that so? Then you saw Dunderklumpen with the treasure chest. And you tricked him and his friends with the counterfeit money so you could get the treasure chest away to teach him a lesson for wanting the treasure in that chest. She'll never be able to handle this. She's too old. They'll be sorry they didn't send me instead. The dummy thinks this is all a dream, so he'll pinch himself. Ah! It's not a dream. 
And now we shall open the treasure chest. You see, One Eye, there is nothing in the treasure chest but the treasures a child saves and the air of freedom. Is he crying? So you see, he really isn't all that rotten and nasty. Is he really, is he really, really crying? crying? Is he crying? Yes, with happiness. Oh, by the fat again. You have the treasure chest? Yes, but there isn't any money in it. What? There's no money in it. And no treasure either. No money at all, but there are treasures. There's a delicate little stone. And a lovely little flower. And a wonderful feather. And the air of joy and happiness that gently blows around us. A delicate little stone. A lovely little flower. A wonderful feather. And the air of joy and happiness that fills us all with gladness, gladness, gladness and swells to a wild, joyous wind. Lucky wind, lucky wind, and Pell and me lot will be glad, I'll be glad, you'll be glad. away our fears it's one nice turn come on and have a dance a kindly wind to dry away my tears i'd like to have a turn and here's my chance I think it's great. I hate to say you're slow. Do you have the 
treasure chest, Jens? Mm-hmm. Imagine, Dunderkolpen really brought those toys to life. <laughs> yes. Look, the sun is rising. We're nearly home. Mm-hmm.